Hello everybody, Phantom Echo here, and welcome back to Digimon Story Hacker's Memory. So let's jump right in. It's a detachment from Cheetos. Looks like it's a shopping list. Box of tissues, cloths, air freshener. He's even included pictures. Is it a case? Just looks like an errand. Anyway, should be able to get everything at Tokyo Handy. I'll head over there now. What the? Hello, I'm with Kamishiro Enterprises. Please visit our company's Eden Cyberspace. Here, show this to Mr. Navid and Eden to receive a free gift. Advertising tissue. It's a flyer with a packet of tissues attached. It's got a picture of a smiling robot on it. Mr. Navid is Eden's mascot. He's in Eden welcoming customers right now. He's at Eden's entrance. You can go there and show this to him. Huh. Saves me the hassle of buying tissues. It's not a box, but it should be good enough. Hey, how's it going? Now I got the tissues. What? You got a packet of tissues with a robot on it. You want to know if it'll do for tissues on the list? Of course it won't. This is a box of tissues. A little packet of robot tissues is nowhere near enough. Everything on the list is in the cafe. Just buy everything in the pictures I sent you. Ooh. Oh. Oh, those clothes. You must be Ryuji's new hire. What? Me? The name's Goro Matayoshi. I can tell you I'm an acquaintance of Ryuji and Cheetos. I was in the area, so I stopped by to see how they're doing. I suppose out now? I see. I'm the brakes, I guess. I also came to say hi to little Erica. I didn't bring her anything, so I'll just come back. Tell Ryuji that Matayoshi stopped by, will you? Say. Don't you get up to any funny business, kid. One wrong move, and I'll bust you, see? Just jerking your chain. Sounded like date for a second there. <laughs> Is he a detective or something? No, oh, he knows Ryuji and the others. Oh. Oh, so we would have run past them at one point. Arrived in Nakano. Should be a few junk shops. Where's the one Cheetos mentioned? It's busy hunting criminals that I haven't been here in ages. I'll just take a look around. The Karemi Detective Agency? Do you need a detective? Kiremi! Kyoko! Welcome to the Kiremi Detective Agency. Come in and we'll talk. Ah! Oh! It's you. <laughs> we should really stop running into each other like this. Yeah, there's a detective from before. I haven't introduced myself yet, have I? I'm sorry, I have a bad habit of being secretive. I'm Kyoko Karemi. As you can see, I'm just a humble detective. I run a detective agency here in Nakano. Let's not stand there talking. Come in. So that makes me wonder if we... Oh. I remember when I first encountered this unusual detective. I was in Shinjuku after I just met Hari. She was investigating something called a digital wave, and I somehow ended up being roped into her investigation. Is something wrong? Are you thinking back to when we first met? You were a great help. 
workload was way more than I could handle by myself. And I was listening to them like I do now. Thinking about it, meeting you is probably what made me realize how much help and assistance could be. I'm grateful. Speaking of assistance, did you see what happened afterwards? It's a shame. Maybe you're a stranger to the supernatural. Wonder what would have happened if you had encountered that digital monster in Shinjuku before me. The whales of fate would have changed the future, and the present would be completely different. Impossible past would have collided, and the world would have vanished. In that case, the existence of a fixed present would be a prerequisite. What? Oh, it's nothing. Forget about it. So that makes things complicated. By the way, you like coffee? Sorry, I didn't offer you some earlier. Celebrate our reunion, I think I'll treat you to my special blend. Special blend? What? Is that a shiver? What's going on? I have a bad feeling about this. Huh? Digital line from Cheetos. How's the case going? You wouldn't get distracted during such an important case, would ya? I saw a spyware on your digivice. I don't know if you're slacking off. Come on. What if I do something like that? But I could if I wanted to. I'm just messing with you. Can't tell if he's kidding or not. Bad feeling about this. I better go. What's the matter? Look, I have to go for now. I need to get back. I guess you must be in the middle of something. I wanted to hear what you thought of my coffee. We can give it another time. Fate seems to be bringing us together. I'm sure the chance will soon be coming up. If you ever need an amazing detective, you can't beat the Karemi Detective Agency. I doubt a high school kid like you can afford to pay much, but there's a little... I doubt a high school kid like you can afford to pay much, but there's more to life than money. Fascinating case is the type of war. Although it's not entirely enough. <laughs> hey, how'd the cases go? Oh, you finished two already? Wow, excellent job. Well then, would you come and eat a little late at Eden? What? Some of my malware is set up around Eden, but it's delicate and requires periodic maintenance. Now we use you or I can go until we finish our reports as Axon. Then you should go on patrol and check out the malware while you're at it. Huh? You gonna be awkward after she just got ticked off at you? Don't worry, she's already over it. Gone now. This is an order from yours truly. Already told Lily, so she'll have logged in already. Meet her at the main entrance. Thanks in advance. Oh, and ask the little lady for the deets. Oh. Going back in. Okay, so we need to go to eat. Oh! I forgot we use a uh, terminal thing. Eating entrance. Eden's main entrance. Public space used by most of Eden's users. I don't see Erica anyway. Should have gotten here before me. Get in touch with her. Is there something wrong with my signal again? Are you just waiting somewhere else? I better look around for a bit. I see Erica anywhere? What in the world? Oh! How long have I been here? Um, since you logged into Eden. What? I didn't know where to catch your attention. Well, uh, let's go. Check the malware Cheetos talked about. Let me just ask. You know what malware is, don't you? My poor head. I really did use one without knowing what it was. Malware is a special virus program made by executing a process on Digimon programs. Kind of programming has always been Cheetos' forte. Alias event.
That kind of programming has always been Chitos' forte. In area surveillance, scanners, logs of users passing through. These old guys are installed all around Eden, each with their own special skills. My brother thought up this method since waiting for a case to come in before gathering info already puts us behind schedule. These malware show the slightest abnormality that will be caught by security, so maintenance is absolutely necessary. I'm not saying Chitos is programming shabby or anything. Just that Eden's admin team is comprised of the best engineers and are brilliant hackers in other teams like Saxon. Leaving an unidentified hacker, Mr. Navit, around, so you gotta be extra careful, okay? Did you hear anything of what I just said? Nope. Like, I was saying, nope. Huh? I look happy when I talk about programs. Well, sure, it's fun. I like programs. In this world, Eden. In this world, I'm, I'm free. And you? Do you like Eden? I like it. Yeah. All right, let's get started. Oh, there's the cat. Hello, get here. This is the rumored spot. I don't see any signs of hacking here. The cat. No way. The cat. There's the cat here. It's getting away after it. Aw, little kitty. What? Wait a minute. What the? <gasps> Another one. What? Oh my god. Cat paradise. Oh my god, deeper into Eden. Let's deeper into Kalu. It disappeared. There's a link to some other place. Is this the hidden room in cyberspace? One second, I'll establish the link. This, this is weird. Impossible, even. A single server shouldn't be able to handle such a fast amount of processing. Logs and traces have encrypted in real time, and it repels normal access. Okay, yes. I got it. Okay, go on in. What? Access granted. User Phantom. Starting transmission. Whoa. Wait a minute. Uh. Is this the new area of Eden? I can't reach Erica. How puzzling. Did someone guide you to this place? Was it your fate? An offshoot of an, the other one's fate? Or perhaps... You don't need to answer. You're already being guided. Must be of some importance. In any case, you've arrived at this place. I welcome you to the DigiLab. DigiLab? Digital Monster Laboratory. DigiLab for short. This place has a faint connection with the digital world, a paradise for Digimon. As of yet, there's no need to teach you the digital world. You'll learn what you must when the time is right. I am Mairai Mikagura. Think of me as the administrator of this place. From here, I've watched over the crossroads of fate. I didn't expect another fork to appear. I have to admit, even I'm surprised. Well, let's leave it at that. For now, allow me to explain what kind of place this is once more. Oh, don't worry. Just an inside joke. <laughs> oh. Seems like you understand the Digilab now. It may seem like a fluke, but there must be some meaning behind your arrival here. Make good use of the facilities and deepen your interactions with the Digimon. Finally, one last thing. A small token for you. What the... Oh, okay. The hacking skills shine in combat with Digimon use, but are dangerous if used for unscrupulous purposes. Still, unlike the other one, you seem to be a true hacker. So I suppose it goes without saying. Looks like it wasn't just your fate, but another source of help that guided you here. 
The girl in white. Even now she tries to get hold of this place. Do ask her to pace herself. This place may seem like your virtual world, but it's actually completely different. You'll never be able to analyze it using your protocols. You seem different from the other one, so I've made a separate entrance for you. Feel free to use it any time. Did she live URL? Now remember. When you arrive at an impasse upon the road, you must walk. Turn to the bonds with the Digimon you have raised for support. That power will surely change your fate. Perhaps even the fate of another. I'll see you later. Take care. Such a strange one. The two wheels of fate begin to turn in completely different directions. This may be proof that the world has expanded far beyond my expectations. I'll assert... I'll ascertain the hidden potential of you and your Digimon with my own eyes. Oh, you're back. What the... Illegal process discovered. Illegal process discovered. Come to the security center at once. What is going on? So, where'd you go? And it's kind of hard to explain, but it's some place. What? Well, I sent you without knowing where you'd go. Hey, I wanted to go myself, but I kept getting repelled. I lost track of you en route, too. Give me your log later. I'll try analyzing it. I also want subjective data. What you observe with your own eyes. What was over there? Oh, purple-haired maiden with a uh, digi lab. I see. That's enough. Let's go. Don't I want to know who that woman was? Not really. My conjecture was pretty much on the ball, so... From your story, I'd have to guess. Name it's a cyber witch. She must be a remarkable hacker. Everything adds up if you think of it like that. The reason we can't perceive the hidden room is in cyberspace is because she keeps moving it around. You can't do that in a place like Eden without processors or on an enormous scale. It's possible for such a thing to exist in Eden. See, they weren't tales of the occult after all. A cat? If we analyze the log, we'll see it was just a... Jeez, think for yourself once. Yeah, don't give me the fish face. What the hell? Have we? What? Wormon. With boss? What the heck? Why is Wormon being attacked? What? Huh? The Digimon's attacking him. Is that Digimon? Yep! Yeah, I'm done for! Go on and help it! Cannon B. Overclock, what? Oh. Ow! Oh, dear God. Uh, rock this? Oh, Lord. This is bad. I think I bought a lot of the allergies. Look at this stuff. Our church. Dear God. 
It doesn't even give me a chance to get like other Digimon, so this is gonna be crazy. Defense up. Peace. That's a hacker. So what's that reaction? We just saved you, you know? Who? Who are you? Don't move. There. I feeled your wounds. I just meant what my brother would do. Are you better now? Yeah, thanks a bunch. You guys are really good hackers, ain't you? I'm Wormon. Nice to meet you. I guess Digimon attack each other too, huh? It's all my fault. I was wandering around Kowloon when I slipped and fell. That Digimon was there and it freaked me out so much that I launched my special move, Sticky Nut. Yeah, that's definitely your fault. Oh, I'm always like this. I was always chased by strong Digimon in my hometown too. Ran off and before I knew it, I ended up here. I don't remember how to get home? I'm lost. Hometown? For Digimon? Uh, yep. My hometown's called the Digital World. The Digital World? Yeah, it's this world separate from this one. Say, this is the human world, right? Our world? This is Eden, the virtual space created by humans. I thought so. I don't know much about it, but I heard there's a place where the digital world overlaps with the human world. Two worlds aren't connected in the beginning, but intersect at some point. I had to use that connection to get over here too. Are you sure you're not bugging out? Huh? Why would you say something like that? There's no way there's another world. It just can't be true. I'm not bugging out. The digital world does exist. Hmm, what do you think? I believe it. <laughs> Thanks a bunch. I think it's a bit hasty to believe such an absurd story so soon. Digital world really exists, honest. All the Digimon in this virtual space came from the digital world just like me. Well, I'm sure that no one knows the engineer who created the Digimon. As programs, they're too perfect to have just formed spontaneously. Still, it couldn't be. So you don't believe me, do you? Fine, I give up. I didn't say I don't believe you. So... I didn't say I believe you, either. 
Let's table this for now. Not enough information to verify your claim. <laughs> Still happy to hear it. You're a nice one, ain't you? No, I'm not. But now what should I do? I'm gonna go back to the digital world, but I don't know how. It's not like we know the answer. What do you want to do about it? Me? Well, I... Just be clear. Don't go counting on me. I don't care about Digimon in the least. That is cold-blooded right there. Jesus. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Wanna come with me? Huh? There's nowhere else to go. You can come with me until we figure out how to get you home. Wow, we Otis, thanks a bunch. I was so lonely by myself. Hip hip hooray! He broke me down. What are you looking at? What was I supposed to do? It's not like I could leave him on his own. He's so happy. And he talks a lot for a Digimon. And he's clumsy. What a weird kid. Still, there's something interesting about him. Thank you for saving him, and, um, sorry for hitting you with Mimitan. But if you come in my room again without knocking, you'll get the same. Hey, Hormon, come on. Okie dokie. See, well, look into the monster that attacked Shiga on our end. You have any idea what it could be? Didn't look like a Digimon to me. We've never seen such a thing. We've heard the same kind of story from other hackers. We're gathering info as we speak. Hey, it's okay to leave Shiga on his own. Maybe he just faked an error and ran off on his account on his own. It's pointless to go out to small fry like that any further. What do you mean by that? There was someone behind the scenes using Shiga and other independent hackers to gather accounts. If we don't beat that guy down, we can't stop the wave of account raids. So, the next case is tracking down the string puller, huh? Looks like you get it. I'd leave it to you. I don't care how you do it. Rest assured, you better not go easy on him. Anyone who crosses Zaxxon's gonna pay, and pay big time. She's a scary woman. What do you know? The gang's all here. You. Well, look who it is. Arata, that has been Hacker Team Jude. You're Fi, Zaxxon's second in command. If I remember correctly, I've heard plenty of rumors. It's been a while, hasn't it? You got some nerve showing your face in front of us, Sonata. Hey, Ryuji, knock it off. You need to apologize after all this time? That again? Let it go already. The past is the past. What'd you say? Seriously, give it a rest. Five's here too. Think about where you are. Don't mind me. Go for it. Ah, think about it. You two used to be injured, right? Even if the team broke up, you old friends should have a nice chat. Look out of your way, so you take your sweet old time. I'll leave the matter where we talked about to you guys. Things are gonna get busy around here. Zaxxon, huh? Guess you guys are all buddy buddy now, huh? So, what's going on with the Eden hackers? These guys have been acting funny lately. More and more of them are running amok. Zaxxon claims to be a pole in the piece, but I don't see it that way. It wasn't this way back in the day. We were more free back then, weren't we, Ryuji? Shut up. Don't talk like you know anything. This has nothing to do with you. You're the one that ran away, after all. Ryuji! Ran away, huh? Can't argue with that. Wait up, Ryuji. 
That wasn't like that, was it? I mean, he had his own stuff going on too, you know? Sorry. What's done is done, yeah? Just don't look like that in front of Erica, okay? That newbie phantom either. We're hurting now, after all. Yeah, you're right. I'll head back after I clear my head a bit. Word. I'll head back first. It's me. Got it. Send me the details. We were more, more free, free back, back then, then, weren't we, Ryuji? Don't gloss over how things really were. Chapter 3, yet another side chapter. Demon Slain, Zaxxon's Request. <sighs> Looks like you've made some reliable allies. K? K? You got it. Looks like Shiko wasn't the hacker you're after. I'm sad to hear it myself. What? You think it's strange I, I know about that? I know the ins and outs of Kelly. It's easy to get my hands on that much info. Plus, Huddy himself is pretty famous among hackers. There's accidents, confidants, you see? Let me give you some advice. Don't go trusting those guys too much. These guys are hackers, after all. They have no idea what they're up to behind the scenes. It was wise of you not to mention me. I don't know what they told you. Uh, don't be tricked by their promises. Who am I, you ask? I'm your ally. Your one and only ally, actually. I'll send you information on your next target. His name is Toru Kayaba. He views his personal information flowing in the darkness through account rating to extort money from people and businesses. He has an impressive collection of accounts. Try and track him down. What in the world could he be after? Toru Kayaba. Thank you everybody for tuning in. If you like the content, be sure to like and subscribe. And as always, this has been Phantom Echo, signing off. Take care and stay safe, everybody. Until the next episode of Digimon Story, Hacker's Memory.